<laughs> All right. Uh, this is my diary. Uh, and uh, I've kept it since I was like 15. My voice uh, teacher when I was in um, high school gave it to me. Let me just read what's on the cover. Inspiration, hopes, and dreams. Create. I've done none of those. Um, <laughs> So um, before I get to the real story, I just want to give you guys a little like idea of what my penmanship in my diary is like. This is from August 27th, 2010. Holy shit. 11.41 p.m. The day before I'm leaving for college. Hey, yo. Uh, there was a reason for that. Thank you. To be told later. Yeah. The day has finally arrived. All of these years I have wondered and prayed to go to college, and a good one at that. Building up to it, though, has been incredibly annoying. <laughs> but whatever. <laughs> Tomorrow I leave and won't be coming back after six weeks from a summer of fun. I don't know what that is. Grade school is a lead up to high school. High school is an incredulous build up to that scary thing known as college, which, which everyone knows is a predetermination for the rest of your life. And if, and if that's true, all of us in this room are fucked. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, here we go. I knew what I was talking about, but college is a lead up to nothing. I, it is the rewards from the bitch load I carried from the past four years. Don't really have much to say now because there's really nothing to say except what I'm going to say after this sentence. I suppose I'm prepared. Suppose I'm prepared. But as to what, I'm not sure at the moment, but it's finally here. The best years of my life, supposedly. People lied about the last four, but here we go. Let's rock this bitch in. Alexandra Michelle Nicholas Matter. Nicholas is my confirmation name. If you don't know what that is, look it up. <laughs> All right. Gretchen, thanks. Hey, thanks for coming out tonight. Um, so this is the real story. Um, when I was a freshman in college, uh, I wrote this. Uh, September 22nd, 2010, 516 p.m. This is the shortest entry I've ever given. I am at college darkness. I don't think I have anything else to say. <laughs> One thing that I will say is that I am a total girl. Tyler. Oh. Yeah. Oh, let's go! Are becoming very physically eye opening. <laughs> <laughs> and that came to the 7 o'clock show and she went, ha ha ha. And it's just the beginning. First three weeks, rad. Next three weeks, even radder. Pick it up! After I did that, I told this person how I really felt, and um, I got rejected. <laughs> Great friends now. Okay, okay, okay. Anyway, so um, this is a song about liking someone if they don't like you back. And this is when the guitar gets the funkiest. Here we go, hey, eight o'clock, dinner at a fancy restaurant. I'm just a bit confused, cause it's really nice here. You were right to dinner in this kick-ass three-piece suit. I wore dated jeans with a hole in the crotch. <laughs> Reach your hand and cross and say that I look pretty. I give a blank stare and say, uh-huh. You start to clear your throat and I get nervous. And you say, you wanna take this to the next level? And I'm like, oh, I love you. But as a friend, platonic love, not actual love. It's when I say I like you, but I actually mean eh. Platonic love, no romance there. When you ask me to marry you, I'll just say, oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> wow, this is awkward. I didn't expect this. I thought we were just two friends getting dinner. Now I guess I understand your forward mode. It's like that time you watched me over to watch Titanic. Rose's hand slapped on the cabin door. And you asked me if I was feeling cold. So I put a blanket down and you slipped your hand in. And you said, are you looking for that m and And I was like, no. <laughs> platonic love, it's not actual love. It's when I say I like you and then I fart. Platonic love, <laughs> and the moment says, when you offer me a pizza, I 
just thought it was, oh, poop jokes are the best. Poop jokes are the best. You gotta get back to the way we were, to the time before you thought I let your sperm, cause all of this awkwardness is really enough, and to tell you the truth, your dick's not big enough. Cause really just oh!